My beloved child, today I want to speak directly to your heart. Listen closely, for these words are for your soul's nourishment and your spirit's strength. I know the burdens you carry, the battles you face, and the doubts that sometimes overwhelm you, but I am here, not as a distant figure, but as a father who loves you deeply and knows every detail of your life. I want you to understand that your struggles are not in vain. They are shaping you, refining you, and preparing you for a greater purpose that you may not yet see. Like this video if you trust God's timing. I have chosen you for a special mission. From the moment you were formed, I had plans for your life, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a future filled with hope. Do not allow the storms around you to make you lose sight of the destiny I have for you. Even when the winds of adversity try to knock you down, remember that I am your refuge, your shelter, and your ever-present help in times of trouble. The storm may rage, but it will not last forever. And through it, I am building resilience and faith within you. Type Amen if you trust God through every storm. There are moments when you feel alone, every storm. There are moments when you feel alone, moments when it seems as if the weight of the world rests upon your shoulders. In those times, I want you to remember that I am right beside you, holding you up with my righteous hand. I have never left your side, and I never will. The road may be long and difficult, but you are not walking it alone. I am with you, step by step, guiding you, protecting you, and leading you to victory. My child, do not be afraid to face the unknown. There are opportunities ahead that I have prepared specifically for you. Trust in me, for I have gone ahead to make a way where there seems to be no way. Seems to be no way. Your current situation may look hopeless, but I am the God of impossible things. What seems like a setback is often a setup for a greater breakthrough, one that will not only bless you, but those around you. You are called to be a light, a beacon of hope and an example of my love to others. I see the people who have hurt you, the betrayals you have endured, and the disappointments you have faced. I know it has been painful, but I need you to release those burdens to me. Forgiveness is not for their sake. It is for yours. Holding on to bitterness only weighs down your spirit and blocks the blessings I want to pour into your life. Let go of the past and trust that I will heal your heart. I am the one who mends brokenness, who binds up wounds, and who brings beauty out of ashes. Donate using super thanks to support spreading God's word. Do not allow the enemy's lies to steal your joy. He will try to convince you that you are not enough, that you are alone, or that your prayers are unheard. But I tell you, my child, that you are more than enough. You are chosen, you are precious, and every prayer you whisper reaches my ears. I am the God who hears, the God who sees, and the God who answers. Your cries are not ignored. They are being stored up, and in my perfect timing, I will act. Trust in my timing, for I know what is best for you. Sometimes the answer comes in ways you do not expect. Sometimes it requires waiting, and I know how difficult that can be. But trust that in the waiting, I am working. I am aligning the right people, the right opportunities, and the right circumstances. 
Be patient and let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete, not lacking anything. When you wait upon me, you will renew your strength. You will rise on wings like eagles. You will run and not grow weary. You will walk and not faint. I have given you gifts, talents, and abilities unique to you. Do not compare yourself to others, for your journey is different. I created you with a purpose that only you can fulfill. Step out in faith and do not fear failure, for I will be with you. I have already equipped you with everything you need to succeed. Remember, I am your provider, your source, and your sustainer. When you walk in obedience and trust, you will see my provision in ways you never imagined. Seek me first, my child, and all these things will be added unto you. When you prioritize my kingdom and my righteousness, I will take care of the rest. I know your needs even before you ask, and I delight in providing for you. Do not worry about tomorrow, for each day has its own challenges, and I am sufficient for them all. Let my peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard your heart and mind. Rest in the assurance that I am your shepherd. You shall not want. Type Amen if you believe God has a plan for you. Remember that you are deeply loved, cherished, and valued beyond measure. I gave my son for you, and there is nothing I wouldn't do to see you thrive. Nothing I wouldn't do to see you thrive. You are my beloved, my chosen one, and nothing can separate you from my love. Not hardship, not trials, not any force of darkness. My love for you is eternal, unchanging, and steadfast. So rise up, my child. Stand firm in your faith. So rise up, my child. Stand firm in your faith. Hold on to my promises, for they are yes and amen. The victory is yours because I have already won it for you. Walk boldly, knowing that I am with you, and no weapon formed against you will prosper. You are destined for greatness, and I have a plan to prosper you, to give you hope, and to give you a future filled with my blessings. Go forth with courage, knowing that my hand is upon you. I bless you with peace, I bless you with strength, and I bless you with the fullness of joy. My grace is sufficient for you and my power is made perfect in your weakness. Walk in my light and know that I am always with you until the end of the age. You are never alone, you are mine, and I am yours. With love, your Heavenly Father. I want you to understand, my child, that every day is a gift from me, an opportunity to grow, to shine, and to experience my goodness. I have new mercies for you every morning, and each sunrise is a reminder that my love for you is unending. Do not dwell on yesterday's mistakes or worries about the future. Live fully in the present, for that is where you will find me. Share this video if you know Jesus is your Savior. You are like a tree planted by streams of water, bearing fruit in its season. Even when the heat of trials comes, you will not wither because you are rooted in me. I am the source of your life, your strength, and your hope. Stay connected to me and you will flourish in all that you do. Your leaves will remain green and you will be prosperous, for my hand is upon you. The fruit you bear will be a blessing not only to you, but to those around you, for you are called to be a vessel of my love and grace. 
I want you to be bold in your faith. The world may offer you temporary pleasures and fleeting joys, but what I have for you is eternal. Do not be swayed by the opinions of others or the temptations that pull at your heart. Stand firm in my truth, for my word is a lamp to your feet and a light to your path. When you feel uncertain or confused, come back to my word and let it guide you. I have given it to you as a source of wisdom, strength, and encouragement. Remember, my child, that you are a light in this world. I have placed my light within you so that you may shine brightly, illuminating the darkness around you. You are the salt of the earth, bringing my flavor, my love, and my truth wherever you go. Do not hide your light, for it is meant to be seen, to bring hope and healing to those who are lost and hurting. Your life is a testimony of my goodness and grace, and through you, others will come to know me. There will be times when your light will be challenged, when the darkness will try to overshadow you. But do not fear, for the darkness cannot overcome the light. I have given you my spirit, a spirit of power, love, and sound mind. Call upon me in those moments, and I will fill you with courage and strength. You are never alone in the battle, for I go before you, and I stand behind you. In the battle, for I go before you and I stand behind you. My angels are encamped around you, protecting you from every side. I know the journey of faith is not always easy. There will be moments of doubt, times when you question your path or wonder if you are truly hearing my voice. Truly hearing my voice. But I am not a god of confusion. I am a god of peace. When you feel unsure, quiet your heart and seek me in the stillness. I will speak to you, not in a loud roar but in a gentle whisper that brings clarity and peace to your soul. I will lead you beside still waters and restore your soul. Type, I love Jesus, if you walk by faith, not by sight. My child, I am also the God of restoration. I see the things that have been taken from you, the dreams that seem shattered and the things that have been taken from you, the dreams that seem shattered, and the opportunities that have slipped away. Know that nothing is lost in my sight. I am the one who can redeem and restore all things. What the enemy meant for evil, I will turn for your good. If the enemy meant for evil, I will turn for your good. Trust me and watch how I bring beauty from the ashes, how I turn your mourning into dancing. I am making all things new. Share this video to remind others that God is in control. Sometimes you may feel like you are in a season of waiting or silence, and you may wonder if I have forgotten you. But remember that in every season there is purpose. Just as the farmer waits for the harvest, so must you trust that there is growth happening beneath the surface, even when you cannot see it. Your faith is being refined, your character is being strengthened, and your heart is being prepared for greater things. Be patient and know that my timing is perfect. I am also the God who provides. I see your needs and I know your desires. Before you even ask, I am already preparing the answer. Do not let worry consume you. Instead, bring your requests to me with thanksgiving, and my peace will guard your heart and mind. Look at the birds of the air. They do not sow or reap, yet I provide for them. How much more will I provide for you, my beloved? 
Trust that I am your provider, and I will meet every need according to my riches in glory. Type 333 inches if you know God is always with you. When you face trials and tribulations, do not see them as punishments, but as opportunities for growth. I am with you in the fire, refining you like gold. The heat may feel intense, but know that it is not meant to destroy you. It is meant to purify you, to bring out the best in you. When you come out of the fire, you will shine brighter than before, and your faith will be stronger. Remember that I am the fourth man in the fire, and you will not be consumed because my presence is with you. There will also be seasons of pruning where things are taken away, relationships are severed, and doors are closed. It may be painful, but trust that I am removing what is not beneficial for you so that you may grow and bear even more fruit. I am the gardener who knows exactly what you need, and I am shaping you into a masterpiece. Let go of what I take away, and trust that what I have for you is far greater. And trust that what I have for you is far greater. My plans for you are good, and they are plans to prosper you and give you hope. Keep your eyes fixed on me, for I am the author and finisher of your faith. Do not be discouraged when things do not go as planned, for I am writing a story with your life that is far beyond what you can imagine. Each chapter has its purpose, and each page brings you closer to the fulfillment of my promises. Trust in the process and know that in all things I am working for your good. My child, I want you to live with boldness and confidence, knowing that you are a child of the King. You have been given authority through my name. Speak life over your circumstances, declare my promises, and watch as mountains move. I have given you the power to overcome every obstacle, and with faith as small as a mustard seed, you can command anything that stands in your way to be removed. Like this video, if you believe God can move mountains, remember that you are loved beyond measure. Nothing you do can separate you from my love. Even when you fall, I am there to pick you up. My grace is sufficient for you and my mercies are new every morning. Do not let guilt or shame hold you back. Come to me with a repentant heart and I will forgive you and wash you clean. And I will forgive you and wash you clean. I am not looking for perfection. I am looking for a heart that is willing and open to my love. Type God is good if he has blessed you. My beloved child, I want you to know that my love for you is unchanging and everlasting. I want you to know that my love for you is unchanging and everlasting. Even when the world feels cold and people turn away, I am the constant in your life. I will never leave you nor forsake you. My arms are open wide, always ready to embrace you, no matter where you are or what you've been through. Come to me, all who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. I am the source of true peace. The peace that the world cannot give and the peace that surpasses all understanding. Like this video, if you know Jesus loves you unconditionally, when you face storms in life, do not be afraid. I am the one who calms the winds and the waves. Even in the midst of chaos, I am in control, and I have the power to bring calm to your soul. Trust that no matter how fierce the storm may seem, I will guide you safely through it. Your life is held securely in my hands, and nothing can snatch you away from me. 
I am your anchor, and I will hold you steady when the world seems to shift beneath your feet. Type, I believe if you know God is working in your life. My child, I want you to have faith like a mustard seed, small yet powerful. Even a tiny amount of faith can move mountains. When you trust in me and believe in my power, you will see miracles unfold in your life. Do not be discouraged by what you see with your natural eyes, for I am working behind the scenes, orchestrating everything for your good. Orchestrating everything for your good. You may not understand it now, but in time you will look back and see how every detail was part of my divine plan for you. I know that you have dreams, desires, and ambitions. I place those within you for a reason. Pursue them with passion, but always align them with my will. When you seek my kingdom first, everything else will be added unto you. However, I want you to know that I am leading you grade by grade. I may not see the entire picture, but I know where you're heading and I understand a means to bring you there. Think that each step is a part of the adventure I've prepared for you. No longer need to look the complete route to know which you are the right one. Believe in me since I am the man within. I, the unseen, am performing miracles on your lives even as you learn. With those words, I am aligning circumstances, shifting hearts, and preparing for rewards. You may no longer see it, but it will eventually become clean, so have confidence. My daughter, because I'm a god of wonders, and my plans for you are more than you may. Consider there is energy and trust while you believe you open the door for. I will contribute to your life in extraordinary ways. Faith moves mountains. My baby, it heals the sick, calms the typhoons, and opens doors that no man can shut while you area your acceptance as real within me you encourage them. Unbelievable into your lifestyles, I want you to accept as truth, even if it appears impossible, but with me, nothing is impossible. Your faith is a light. Light shines within the darkness, it is a beacon that lures you closer to me. If the sector around you is uncertain, the more you trust, the more you'll see. Excellent I am at drawing on your lifestyles and the things that once appeared in apparent changes into clean, you may look back and observe how my hand turned into guiding you all along as my love became supporting you through even the most difficult moments. Yet religion isn't just about believing in the unseen, it is also about movement. Religion without works is meaningless, my lover. Call you to live out your faith in your daily life and let your vision of me impact the way you Admire the manner in which you serve and the manner in which you remain. Allow your faith to be a beacon to others and an affidavit to the world of my presence in your life while you stay in faith and you will become a conduit through which my love and style can pour. The world, my beloved, knows that your faith is precious to me, it is a gift. There is nothing too big or too small for me. I delight in seeing you thrive and accomplish the dreams I have placed in your heart. Take those steps of faith and watch how I open doors that no one can shut and lead you into new opportunities. Share this video to spread the love of Jesus.